Tara here. Today I'm going to show you how to get your Facebook followers and friends to engage more. Um, you can also use this in Twitter posts, tweets, um, any other blogs you have. It's basically how to get people to respond, comment back, and like and share. So, um, these are just some simple things that you can implement as soon as you listen to me talk about them. And remember that a lot of this is very, very crucial because um, by you responding back or engaging with your followers, it shows them that you're a real person and people need to know you're a real person. All right, so let's get started. All right, stay fresh. What's that mean? Keep your content fresh, something new every day. If you can't do it every day, do two things on the day you missed day after you missed. Uh, staying fresh is very, very important. People need fresh content daily. If you want them to stay engaged with you and notice you and like you. So by you posting um, new videos, blog posts, uh, posting something on Facebook every day, tweeting every couple of hours, this can really, really help you in your business. Next is what I like to call spaced out. What this means is to space out your posts. Facebook, Twitter, uh, YouTube, no, not so much. But instead of doing like, say, five posts on, we'll use Facebook, five posts on Facebook right in a row, you're actually better off spacing them out, waiting a few hours, doing a post every two hours, every three hours, one in the morning, afternoon, and night, as rather than posting like boom, 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 back to back. It's not very effective. It'll be more effective if you do it every couple of hours. And this goes for Twitter as well. So the next one we're going to talk about is like and share. Um, this is one I'm actually starting to get used to and I, I never put in some of my videos or posts. Um, now when I make a video, and you'll see it at the end of this one if I remember, to, you know, hey guys, thanks for watching my video. Like comment and share this video if it can help you or help somebody else. Um, by saying that, it gives them a call to action. It's tell them to do something. Tell them to do something. You got their eyes on your video. Tell them to do something. It's not hard, but don't forget to do it. And you can do this in your blog post as well. Um, this will basically, you know, it, it just, it can really work wonders for you, believe it or not. Uh, making a schedule. I use socialoomph.com uh, I'll put a link to it in this video. And just go there, browse around. Basically, you can schedule out posts, tweets, whatever you want. And this is so uh, you can use your time learning other things rather than tweeting and posting constantly. Social Inf will do it for you automatically. Um, let's get to this one. Say what? Say what? When I say say what... What I mean is questions, questions, questions. You need to ask questions on your tweets. You need to ask questions on your posts. By you asking questions, people are going to talk back. People love to answer questions, especially when they know it. they got to be the first to answer it. So trust me, it works. Um, last but not least is think big. Post pictures. Pictures, pictures, pictures. Why? They are the biggest thing on that news feed in your Facebook Um Somebody's probably going to read what a picture says more than a status. They'll just swipe, swipe, swipe. So let them see it in a picture and read it in a picture. All right. So like I said, if you like this video, like, share, comment below. Do something with it. Help somebody out, please. And if you want to do what I do and get started in my business, how I am able to stay at home and make the income of my dreams, um, click the button below to join or get a free video on what I do. All right, bye.